You all seem to like the trick of how to get a dross-free cut on a handheld plasma cutter, and I asked a simple question in that video if y'all want to see it on a CNC table. Let's get into it. Get out of here. Straight moving. Now we're gonna go 350 inches per minute. Woo. I definitely started seeing a little drag. Now we're gonna run 16 gauge. 150, 150. All right, so we cut this first one here at kind of more optimal speeds. We can look at the dross on this one. Man, that looks really good. We got some little schmutz in the corners here. The circle is clean as can be. A little bit of dross in the corners there. It looks like a really nice cut. It's hard to tell if anything is cut square on 16 gauge because it's just so thin. This was the 350 inches per minute. I'd say there's significantly less dross on there. Definitely less dross. However, as far as a right angle goes, I feel like these corners got a little bit rounded off a little bit more. It looks like we could potentially pump up the numbers that I'm seeing as far as a 45 amp consumable 16 gauge and what the cut chart is telling me. I'm able to go 100, almost 100 inches a minute more uh, and still be able to cut this part. So these are the things that you need to consider. Now looking at this one we cut a lot slower, you should know this from our other videos. If you want a drossy part, you cut slow. This one was cut at still 150 inches per minute. And we still got just so much dross on every inch of this thing. 